Here's a great example of how freezing in the middle of your run can really mess you up. I'm running my young agility dog, Miria, and you see that she refuses the tunnel here. Now a lot of people would say that this was caused by inexperience on the dog's part. And it doesn't look like I've done anything obviously wrong. But if we go back and take a look at the video, you can see exactly what happens. I'm moving forward well. I start to slow down here, which cues a little bit of a turn. Now watch. Here's her takeoff point. You see her feet are on the ground, and then they move into the air. And as she's taking the jump, I don't move at all. By the time my right foot comes up, you can see it right here, she's already about to land. When I time this on the video analysis, I lost two tenths of a second, 0 0.2 seconds, just standing there watching her take the jump. So that by the time she actually lands and I start to move, she's already curled toward me and is now facing the wrong way instead of facing toward the tunnel, which is where I want her to go. This is dead time. Once the dog is in the air, they can't change their path. And that's the perfect time for you to drive forward and move into position so you can get them facing the correct way. So on my next try, I did a little bit better job of not coming to a complete stop and really driving forward rather than staring and watching her go over that jump. And you see we get a much better performance.